trying to figure it out here, but uh, definitely going to need to find the nearest runway. Mixer 3, Papa, we got Taft Airport is your uh, 251 to 13 miles. Meadows Field is about uh, 9 or 19 miles north of you, which has all kinds of FBOs. Okay, we're coming to Meadows here, and uh, can I get a vector? Grand 3, Papa, take the field altimeter, 2978, wind at Meadows Field, 290 at 9 or just 18, and the uh, 8 is frequency 118. Okay, thanks. Uh, you got anything closer for Grand Papa? You need a closer airport, you say? Yeah, this isn't working out here. What's Lima 45, about 10 miles away? Yeah, Lima 45, bearing 034 for 10 miles. Okay, we're trying to make it there. And can I just say, Papa, you're the same emergency at this time? Uh, you know, we're going to try to get it running here, and uh, I'll let you know in a second about that. Uh, Command to three, top of the airport, 040 at 7.9 miles. Okay, we're looking. Command to three, here, it seems like we have a fuel pump issue, but we will declare an emergency and we need to uh, uh, definitely be first in line here. Okay, we are declaring an emergency. We, did, we have called the uh, fire department. L45 is an unmanned uh, airport. There is uh, service there, but there's no tower. So uh, the current county is aware. Thank you, sir. Director 3, Papa, go ahead. Just remain in Springsea now. We're talking on Unicom over there. Okay, thanks, Dan. Yeah, I appreciate that. If you could do that for me. Yep, got it covered. Director 3, Papa, just want to verify you do have the airport site. Yes, sir, we do. We made a broadcast there on Unicom and had no response. Thank you. Great to see you, Papa. South of the runway, there are power lines, uh, a lot of houses around the area, not much uh, to put it down there. Yeah, you know what I'm seeing here, and uh, if we're going to have to do that, we, we, may, uh, we may do that too. Good. Great to see you, Papa Roger. Uh, we do have a position on you about a mile through the airport. Okay, we are talking with uh, law enforcement and the fire department. They should be up here. Yeah, Papa, thanks. Thanks, Nancy. Papa, uh, you can hang on the street as long as possible. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Papa Roger. Good job. Uh, there's uh, law enforcement on the way out there. Okay, that was up to Chaco and Cottonwood. All right, thank you. We'll uh, we'll pass that on to the law enforcement. Yeah, if, uh, if we lose the radios or whatever, um, they should be there shortly. If you're still on the radio, let us know because you see uh, them coming at you. Did you need a phone number for here? Did you need, uh, let me give you that phone number uh, to get a chance to call us. Area code 661-861-4325. You bet, and the uh, supervisor there. If you do give us a call when you get time, when you get to the time. Uh, United 15, you guys ready? Uh, so we're going to have to uh, stop here, and I'm going to have to go and do a uh, wing inspection, so it's probably going to be about five minutes before we're ready for departure. Right, sir, just advising you're ready to go again. Current RVR, runway 4 left, 3,500. Okay, and uh, when was the last time the runway was uh, plowed and or swept? It was swept a half hour ago, about 35 minutes, because I had just left the position at the time. All right, thank you. Hey, Tower, United 15? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, we got birds on the runway here. You got birds on the runway? Well, we got one. He's walking across the center line. You better be moving pretty soon. Oh, here comes his wife. She's coming, too. <laughs> his wife is coming? Wait for the kids. It's Christmas time. Hey, you always see the geese on Christmas, right? 
Yeah, so true. You want to uh, go into position or you want to hold short? Want me to get a vehicle to sweep before you there, United 50? Well, you know what, they're gone, but quite honestly, from, from what we can see here, it's not looking real good for takeoff. We'll see what the first officer says when he comes back, but your runway is looking pretty obscure as the lights. I couldn't even see the stop line for the runway. Oh, really? Okay, let me walk over there and take a look at the light uh, readings right now. They brighten up any for you? Uh, they, yeah, actually they do, because you can see them coming through the snow finally. Okay, excellent. I just put it on a night setting and less than one mile visibility. Yeah, good, because you couldn't see the stop bar for the runway. Okay. You know what, Power, can you have somebody come look at this runway before I taxi on? I think, I can't go with hardly any clutter because we're heavy today, and it's, it's looking like it's pretty good. You want me to taxi on and take a look at it? Yeah, if you want, you can taxi on to the runway. Uh, you know, I'm ready to let you go if you want to leave. Uh, it's your choice, though, ma'am. Proceed on the runway uh, four left. You can line up and wait. All right, but we'll go out and line up and wait. Let, me, let us look at runway and see what we think. Okay, sounds good. Right now, RVR 4,500. Okay, it's how you know, 15. You'd like to taxi back to the gate. Out of 15, Roger, taxi down, runway 4 left. You can exit, uh, let's say, at taxiway. No, oh, take it on down. Then that way you give me a little surface report also. Exit the taxiway. Uh, let's make it golf. Okay, down at the uh, golf. And uh, I'll give you my assessment. It's starting to drift on the runway right now. And a couple, three-inch drifts uh, kind of right on the center line here. Roger, understand drifting piles up there. Okay, thank you. I appreciate it. United, this is Delta. Are you getting some drifts on the runway? You know, it's starting to uh, form some clumps right in the center line, just to the uh, right of the center line. We're starting to get a little bit of a drift starting to form. Maybe it's a few inches. Well, left is officially closed. They're going to come out and clean it. Roger. 